Snail Trail, A Journey Through Modern Art by Joe Saxton Here is a tale about a snail, an art-loving snail with a silvery trail. He's small but colourful, clever and sweet. If you follow his trail, you're in for a treat. There's a special picture I'd like you to see. A famous artist based it on me. Turn the pages of my book and I will teach you how to look. This picture's tall, but it's too black. My portrait doesn't look like that. Here, there are drips as well as drops. My picture, though, is built of blocks. Ah, much neater, that's for sure. But my picture's colours aren't mixed, they are pure. This is better, but do you see? The squares in this picture don't look like me. This strange painting is far too hot. Melting clocks and desert rocks, a place for a snail. This is not. Well... This one's cooler, but it's too blue. Mine has more orange and lilac too. This looks more like it. The artist is right. Just one more page and the end is in sight. Hooray! We found it! Can you see? This is Matisse's portrait of me. He's made my body a block of blue, with my shell a spiral of every hue. An orange border makes the frame. This picture's brought us both great fame. It's now in a London gallery. I hope one day you'll come and see. When Matisse made my picture, he was an old man, recovering from an illness which had weakened him. Young art students often helped him to work at this time. They painted sheets of paper in many different colours for Matisse and he cut or tore them into the shapes he wanted. The students then hung the pieces on the wall just as he told them to and when he felt everything looked just right, they were stuck down. This way of making a picture is usually called collage but Matisse liked to call it painting with scissors and you can see him doing it here.